Being a good gymnast takes strength, coordination, flexibility, and discipline. It's just dedication, hard work, and, and the ability to, to cope with delayed gratification. Um, you're not gonna succeed early. It's gonna take a long, long time, um, but you can get there, and it's doable, and Nick has proven that. Seattle Prep senior Nick Kubler has been competing since he was nine. Now at 18, Nick has vaulted to the top. Last year, he took first place in floor routine and second in the all-around at the U.S. Championships. He's been consistently placing in the top five at national championships and junior Olympics since he was 12. He's definitely the most talented gymnast, I think, that I've seen, just pure natural ability, and he's really dedicated. Nick trains with his coaches at Metropolitan Gymnastics in Kent five to six days a week, four hours a day. It doesn't give him much free time, but Nick doesn't seem to mind. I guess it, someone could call it a sacrifice, but to me, I view it just as a part of the sport. You're not gonna, and for everything in life, there's always something that you're gonna have to sacrifice. So to me, I just view it as something that I need to achieve, or it's something that has to get checked off in order for me to be able to achieve my goals. Nick comes from a sports family. His mom was a member of the Russian national gymnastics team. His dad was a swimmer. Nick says taking flight is tough to top. Oh my gosh, it's, it's amazing, especially on the high bar when you're doing a backflip in the middle of the air and then catching the bar again. It, it, it gets your heart pumping and scary for sure, but it's so rewarding. Having balance in gymnastics is key, as in life. Nick takes his academics very seriously, and with a 3.95 GPA, he will head to Stanford next year to compete on a Cardinal team that won the national championships in 2019. While many kids dream big, Nick sets goals instead. Yeah, I would say goal big instead because to me I view dreams as being more of something, well a dream is you, you don't really experience the reality of it, but for goals it's something you can set and it's something that's attainable. So everything that I truly want to achieve, I'll set it as a goal rather than a dream. And while Nick has plenty of goals for Stanford, he also wants a gold medal. I'd like to win Olympics on either all around Palm Horse or honestly any event would be great, but yeah, that's, that's definitely a goal in the future. Nobody can predict the future, but all the good things that are coming to him, he deserves. Great kid with a bright future. By the way, we just got done taping our Prep Zone holiday special. It will air Christmas night. It is a great one. Seven to eight stories of kids that we did during the 2020 season. Jessica, Mark, let's send it back to you. Oh, some great stories for sure. Chris, thank you. We'll be right back.